what is good John welcome back to yet again another vlog welcome back to yet again another video welcome back to the J.I. Productions channel and welcome back to the J.I. squad if you hit the subscribe button already and turn on those post notifications you're already a part of the J.I. squad what it do you know we got it on the merch you feel me got it on the joggers got it on the hoodies got it on the t-shirts got it on the long sleeve tees we got it everywhere man so if you haven't already go to official underscore byo dot shop on instagram and tap in to get your merch but as you guys can see by the top today's title and thumbnail i'm just gonna give you guys a quick little update man it's gonna be a short video nothing long nothing crazy just want to talk to you guys real quick and let you guys know what i know you know as I've been doing YouTube for about four years now, four or five, almost five years, um, I've always been transparent with you guys. I've always kept it a buck with you guys and let you know everything that's going on. Um, I never kept you guys in the dark, so I'm not gonna start now. I told you guys I would keep you guys uh, in the loop with everything that's going on with the insurance. So with that being said, I got an update. y'all so as y'all can see we are in the ji hq and unfortunately it is empty one of the um saddest things about this entire situation is that i never got to do an install i well let me correct myself i have yet to do an install in the ji hq yet alone do a full vlog in the ji hq so it kind of sucks but it is what it is man um I got an update. So, first and foremost, just wanna say Merry Christmas, Happy Kwanzaa, Happy Hanukkah, uh, and Happy New Year's to everybody, you know what I'm saying? If you celebrate it, if you don't, either way it goes, Happy Holidays from J.I., you know what I'm saying, to you guys. So, um, basically, uh, you know what I'm saying, was talking to the insurance um, about the car and everything, so last, uh, update I think I gave you guys was when we went to the tow yard um, so if you guys haven't seen that video I'll go ahead and put a card up right here make sure you guys go tap in you know what I'm saying it's either right there or it's right there one of the two make sure you guys go tap in because some of my stuff did come up missing uh, when I went to go check on the car for the first time see the car in the light for the first time I definitely seen uh, more damage than I could see during the day of the event um, just because it was at night, but basically, um, the insurance was telling me that, you know what I'm saying, they were going to go get the car, that way they can confirm that it's going to be a total loss, and then start working on getting me a, you know what I'm saying, a settlement, like, tell me how much the check is going to be. Now, I want to make one thing very, very clear, I think I mentioned this already, um, this was a brand new loan, you know what I'm saying? And for those of you who don't know how, you know what I'm saying, financing a car works, basically the dealership has their price on the car, you know what I'm saying? And then you fill out an application with all of your information, how much you're making, um, your social, your credit scores, all of that or whatever. And basically the dealership takes that information and they shotgun it to about 20 different bureaus, um, you know what I'm saying? and they see who is gonna accept it. Um, and then based upon that information, the bank or the bureau, the credit agency, whoever um, accepts you will basically say, okay, bet, we're gonna give you this much, but we're gonna charge you this much interest. So you're basically going to be financing, say the car was 30,000, um, you have really bad credit, then you'll be financing about 35 to 40 uh, with no money down if you're not putting any money down or whatever it just depends APRs and stuff like that is different but anyway um, now with that being said it is a brand new loan um, I only paid only made two payments with the car in my possession not with it running just with it in my possession um, I made the third payment literally the Monday after the accident happened um, I'm about to make the next payment next month. With that being said, the check is going to be what the car is worth. And with that being said, the car is a 2016 Mustang GT. 
it ain't gonna be worth that much money. You know what I'm saying? So with that being said, um, I got this thing called Gap. Now, what basically happens with Gap is you have regular car insurance and then you have Gap insurance. The car insurance is gonna, like I say, give you the car's value. And then whatever is missing from the total, so insurance gives you this much, which is the value, this little gap between the total and what you got from insurance, gap insurance comes in and they cover that. So you don't have to pay anything out of pocket. So with that being said, um, the way I'm seeing it is insurance is gonna give me this much um, and gap is gonna have to come in and take care of the rest. So the new car, the next car for the channel is coming out of the pockets, brother. You know what I'm saying? So if you haven't already, quick shameless plug, tap in with the merch, official underscore BYO dot shop. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you get on there, make sure you get some merch. Um, I am dropping a limited time design for the Reaper uh, drop. You know what I'm saying? I have the logo already, as you guys have seen. Um, but I think I'm gonna do a limited amount of merch for the pieces, so I might do 40 pieces, pieces each, and that'll be it. You know what I'm saying? Since I only had the car for four months, I think that's what I'm gonna end up doing. So if you guys haven't already, make sure you go over there, go tap in, follow uh, the page, like some of the pictures, uh, submit your order if you have one already, you wanna get some of the regular OG uh, Mamba J.I. merch, or you wanna get some J.I. Squad merch, whatever you wanna do, all of those are available up on the site, so make sure you guys go tune in. But um, yeah, man, uh, the insurance people, you know what I'm saying, talked to them yesterday, uh, because I still have no car. As you guys can see, the HQ is empty. Um, I've been sliding with my boy Money in the morning for work, and then my girl come pick me up when uh, when I get off work. So it's cool, you know what I'm saying? I still got a way to get around. Always gonna have a way to get around, no cap. But basically, like I was saying, I was talking to the insurance and uh, they basically came to the conclusion, um, it is a total loss, the car is gonna be a total loss. They're just working on getting the, um, the adjuster to go ahead and you know adjust the car and see how much it's gonna be worth and whatnot. And then they'll go ahead and write the check to the dealership and you know do what they gotta do to get that stuff out of my name. Um, what I'm currently waiting for and what you guys are currently waiting for is the total loss letter. Once you have that letter that says, hey, this car is a total loss and it's no longer, you know what I'm saying, gonna be on your credit, that helps so much as far as getting a new car. Um, because right now, if I was to walk into a dealership and go try to get a new car, which I could definitely do, I could go put some bread down on a car right now, real talk. Um, but the only issue is gonna be, why do you need two cars? Why do you need two car payments? Why do you need two sports cars at that? You know what I'm saying? I'm only 22 years old, uh, so that's gonna be a whole bunch of red flags, you feel me? So with that being said, I'm waiting for that total loss letter right now. Um, they say that they should have the claim wrapped up sometime by the end of this week. That's my boy Back to the Money calling right now. You know what I'm saying? Five minutes later. That's my boy Back to the Money right now, so I gotta go ahead and close this video up. But yeah, man, I'm just waiting on the total loss letter. As soon as I get that letter, we will be going to go get the new car. I have been shopping around. I have found a couple cars that I like. So with that being said, man, if you haven't already, make sure you smash that subscribe button. Turn on those post notifications. Drop a comment in the comment section down below. And just stay tuned, because I'm telling y'all, the new whip, the new whip, Telling y'all that joint five, boy. You ain't gonna wanna miss it. So make sure you guys subscribe. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.